in a world without tips, there can only be one who can rise up and bring the tips. There can only be one who has all the knowledge and brings us the tips. Welcome to Book Brush Tips with Anthony. Today, we're gonna learn a brand new thing, how to make animated, animated signatures. signatures. What is up guys? It is me, Anthony. I hope you're having a great week. And guys, I'm going to teach you something brand new to Book Brush. It is our email animated signatures. And I'm going to show you just how to use them. So first thing you're going to do is you're going to go over to our custom creator. Then, in the left hand corner, hit community templates. And you'll see a new feature added right there called collections. Click that. We have static email signatures and we have animated email signatures. And I'm going to show you the animated ones. So click that. We have 10 templates right now to choose from that are fully customizable to fit your needs. So let's pick one real quick. I'm going to pick this one down here, Michael Maxwell. I'm going to play it for you real quick. How cool is that to make your emails that you send out stand out with the animated signature at the bottom? So I'm going to teach you how to edit it real quick. So if you're familiar with the custom creator, you know you have your text box tool where you could edit what your text looks like. You could, you could pick whatever font you want, change the size you want, and you could do that for all of that stuff. Your website, you could double click and put your own website in I'm gonna call it book br book brush bookbrush.com and so you have your book and just like in all things you could swap by hitting the lighting bolt or double clicking and going up here to the top corner and says swap covers and we will just pick something different The mark man and we will pick we'll change the author to Kristen and this is just for an example so after you do that you could also change the color of your font you maybe you want it to be the same color as the book so use your eyedropper and use our special feature the color picker boom and then maybe we want this background behind our picture to be different so you double click and change the color of that you can match it there and let's change our picture so we'll delete this picture and I'm going to show you how to add the animation right back to it so you will find your picture of you I have a bunch of stock images here so I'm just gonna pick a random one here and don't forget you could always use some credits to use the background removal tool to remove the background so there's what it looks like with a background here's what it looks like without a background how cool is that so you could always buy more credits and do that with our background removal tool then you can kind of customize it there how you want it so to add animation to your picture you'll want to double click go down here to the left hand click add animation see all 100 plus animations and let's do something cool like a fade in down so let's play that back boom that's the only animation you have to change all the rest stay the same as the template and it's as easy as that so you'll see this at the bottom 499 click below you could change that to say what you want like if you're having a special for $1.99 you can say that click below let me explain that a little bit and we'll also put a link to our YouTube channel so that you can watch some video tours on how to insert this into your email um, you'll want to 
make maybe a link below in your email that says like amazon.com slash wherever it is you're selling your book or whatever website you're selling on wherever you want to put a link below so that so that in the email they can click on that and it takes them to that website and we'll put a link in the 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 comments below in the description so that you can see what I'm talking about other than that that's as simple as that creating your email signature that's animated it's pretty cool and it'll make your email stand out to all your author friends the want one just like you then of course save your project and then you could download it as an mp4 and then in the video that I'm talking about on YouTube you can find out exactly how to convert this into your email signature thanks guys